Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Y'all ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, it's your girl, T. So I want to come on here and talk about the whole Tyson Beckford and Kim Kardashian situation, honey. So before I get started, in case you missed my last video, if you're buying tea off of my website or if you're buying it off of Amazon, please do not forget to review the tea. We need more reviews. We're trying to get the tea out there. Look out for your girl, okay? I'm going to continue to remind you guys to please review my tea, okay? Thank you so much. All right, back to the dang on video. So if you guys don't know, honey, the other day on August 1st, the Shade Room, and a bunch of other media outlets. They posted a picture of Kim Kardashian in this little outfit with these little clear shoes. I don't know, it was a weird outfit, okay? But not only was the outfit weird, her body looked strange. Her hips looked disheveled. I don't know, she just looked strange, okay? And you know, a lot of people were praising her because you know, we got a lot of sheeps who praise anything. But Tyson Beckford looked at the picture and he was like, nah, fuck that shit. You look weird as hell. What the fuck is going on? Your doctor did a fucked up job. He did a botched surgery. One hip is bigger than the other. Basically, he was being super messy, honey. When I tell you Kim Kardashian was like, what? Oh, hell no. A black man who's not feeling all of this? You got me fucked up, sis. She literally questioned the man's sexuality just because he went in on her botched booty, okay? This entire situation's a hot damn mess. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys this back and forth. Go ahead and check this out. So Tyson Beckford says she is not real. Doctor fucked up on her right hip. And so people started commenting back. And then all of a sudden, Kim Kardashian came on there and she was like, sis, we all know why you don't care for it. And then put the little teacup emoji and the nail polish emoji. All right, so you guys just saw that back and forth. So once that went viral, of course, Kim Kardashian, Tyson Beckford, they were trending. This was on Monday. You know, people were accusing Kim Kardashian of basically being homophobic and trying to shame his sexuality and then trying to blast him and say he was gay, even though he's never come out as gay or bisexual, any of that stuff. So this entire situation was crazy. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the tweets, the comments, and what folks have to say about Kim Kardashian's clapback. Go ahead and check this out. All right, so you guys just saw what people had to say. A lot of people were mad at Kim calling her homophobic. Other people were mad at Tyson Beckford, and they're basically saying that he was body shaming. So Tyson Beckford, basically, he doubled down on everything. And as of today, when I tell you this man has been taking a Snapchat, he is now the official petty king, okay? He done snatched Big Sean's title, okay? Tyson Beckford is being petty as hell. He would not let his foot off of Kim Kardashian's neck. He's going in on her, and you know what? I'm here for it, bitch, okay? So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys his Snapchats, what he had to say, and all this stuff he's been posting over the past 24 hours, honey. He ain't had this much attention in a long time. So Tyson Beckford said, you know what? Fuck this shit. I'm about to ride this damn Kim Kardashian wave. Go ahead and check this out, and I'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary. <laughs>
honey. I told y'all he was being petty as hell. So anyways, you know what? I can respect him for that. Say what you say and stand by that shit, okay? A lot of people are tired of all these fake plastic bodies and these breast implants and fake asses. A lot of people are tired of like the plastic surgery fad, okay? Like I've always said, do what you want to do to your body. That's your business. But when it starts getting over-exaggerated, when it doesn't even look natural, like this picture of Black China that leaked online recently, like a few weeks ago... Her ass looks crazy. It literally looks like she's walking around with two beach balls, okay? And then the dimples and just she just looks strange, you know what I mean? I think when plastic surgery gets out of control like that, I think people are right to call it out, you know what I'm saying? If you wanna get work done, it should look more natural. Look at her sister, Courtney. Kourtney Kardashian has gotten work done and she looks beautiful. You know, she looks natural. It's not over the top. It's not over exaggerated. You know, things like that. I don't think he was body shaming her at all. I think the reason why Kim Kardashian got into her feelings and called him sis, okay, is because she's used to being praised, especially by black men, okay? She's used to people praising her for her body, for her lips, for her figure, for just for everything, especially by men of color. So when she sees a black man who's not fawning at her feet and who's not kissing her fake ass now she's in her feelings okay but I will say that clap back was funny because let's let's keep it 100 okay stop with the homophobic stuff let's keep it real they have been rumors for years okay in the industry that Tyson Beckford is bisexual that he goes both ways that he's gay these are not you know these rumors have been around for years Kim didn't start that rumor you know what I mean so I think he had a really good point and she had a funny clap back you know what I'm saying she went at his ass and then he doubled down and he stood by what the hell he said you know what I mean in his damn Nene Leaks voice, I said what I damn said, bitch, okay? He's not going to let Kim Kardashian or Kris Jenner claiming that she don't know who Tyson Beckford is. Uh, Who's Tyson? Yes, he's not going to let that affect him, okay? He's going to continue living his best life and doing him and only talking to girls or guys with natural bodies, okay? I know that was shady, but whatever. Y'all are here for it, right? Okay? Anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire messy situation, honey. Once again, concerning Tyson Beckford and Kim Kardashian going back and forth. Because Tyson Beckford, you know what I'm saying, is not feeling her body. He's not feeling the plastic surgery. He's not feeling what she's done to herself. How do you guys feel about their back and forth? Do you feel like Tyson Beckford was body shaming? He's being petty. Or do you feel like, you know, Kim Kardashian was being homophobic? Or do you feel like, you know what, he clapped on her, she clapped back, you know what I'm saying? All is fair and love and war honey so let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment all right deuces <laughs> hey you guys it's your girl t and i hope you really enjoyed that video if you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals definitely feel free to click my description box there's plenty of information in there please stay tuned for the next video talk to y'all later